And hello everyone and welcome back to Hump Day Scary Play. I'm your host, Nicodemus Kane, and I used to go out every Wednesday and try to find a random video game that I could play, something I had never heard of before. And it slowly dropped off. But I said we are going to resurrect Hump Day Scary Play, which means that every Wednesday in October, we go out and we try to find some scary random video game that we can play, something I've never played before. You know, play through the first 15 minutes of it, just see what the heck it is, just to get a feel for what's out there. Because, you know, there's a lot of games out there, and I don't get to play all of them. So I figured we'd go take a look at some of the stuff we get. Uh, this is the Amnesia Collection. This is on the PlayStation 4. Uh, we get this free with a PlayStation Plus membership for the month of October. I just downloaded it last week. Haven't touched it. Have never played it. I've seen a lot of guys play little bits of it here and there. But I have... I've never played it myself. I don't really know too much about it. I know it's kind of crazy, kind of scary. It, it's a little weird. Um... I don't know anything about uh, what the separation is. I've heard, I've heard that the mach uh, machine for pigs is, is pretty wild. I've I've heard it gets crazy. Justine, I don't know anything about Justine. I didn't even know there was one called Justine for it. And this dark scent, I don't know anything about this either. So, uh, um, let's just pick one. This one's the first one, apparently. So maybe we should just go ahead and do this. It kind of looks like it's a very like gothic background like it's what is it like Skyrim <laughs> is, is that gold pieces on the floor down I don't know I don't know let's go ahead and get into it why not let's do it Ooh. Ooh, I'm already spooked out not really oh it's a rose okay the game features auto saving when you see this icon don't turn it off I'll try not to Frictional Games with support from Norden Nordic Game Program. Right. Dude, I thought that said butt works. I was going to be like, what the f <laughs> Welcome to Amnesia the Dark Descent. What follows is a couple of quick messages on how to get the best possible experience. Oh, man. Amnesia should not be played to win. Instead, focus on immersing yourself in the game's world and story. Do not worry about when and how to save during a game. The game take care of that. When you want to leave a game, save and exit and continue. Yeah. World of Amnesia is a dangerous place and you are extremely vulnerable. Do not try to fight the enemies encountered. Instead, use your wits, hide, and or even run if necessary. You know, play between a hug. It just it looks good to me. <laughs> Let's be honest, it looks good to me. That is all. Hope you enjoy immerse yourself in the world of amnesia, frictional games. Okay, let's go. It's an upside down sun. All right, maybe I should have come into this screen first. Hell, I don't even know. we're just gonna leave it as is. Um, show subtitles. Show effect subtitles. Uh, effect subtitles. Uh, okay, we that'll work for me. I, I I suppose. Is there any anything else that we really need to worry about here? Do we need to turn the gamma up or down a little bit maybe up just a tiny bit all right anyways now that we've uh totally bored the shit out of everybody let's jump into this yes start a new game again i know nothing about this um those are uh those are satanic rooms that's nice Uh, Don't boy. forget, some things mustn't be forgotten. Things mustn't be forgotten. Shadow hunting me. I must hurry. My name is Daniel. I live in London at, at uh, Mayfair. What okay. have I done? This is crazy. Don't forget. Don't forget. I must stop him. Focus. My name is... Daniel. Ooh. Yeah, we're only going to go 15 minutes on this, like I said. Uh, that should give us a general idea of what this is. If it's any good, uh, well, I might pick it back up. We might do a playthrough of it. I don't know. Because I've heard that this whole series was really, really good. That it's one that you just you need to sit down and play and enjoy. But I don't know anything about it. I've never played it. 
Okay, so I have a dot. I have a tracking dot right in the middle. Wow. It feels a little sensitive. Uh, hint, a memento has been added to the journal. Make sure to check these whenever you are stuck. What's the notes? No notes are available. Diaries? No diaries are available. Mementos! Follow the liquid trail and find its source. I'm almost wondering if maybe uh, this is going to be too easy for me. God, it is very sensitive. Okay, we're going this way. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the hell? What the hell was that? What the hell was it? Oh my god. The fuck is going on? Um, guys, really, how do I. Do I. Hold down R1 to move. Yeah, you guys don't want to keep those doors. It's kind of drafty in here. You know? Okay. Okay. This is creeping me out, man. This is fucking creeping me out, man. Was that? Dude. This is not Skyrim. Holy fuck. What in the world is going on? See, man, you guys got some drafts in this house, man. You guys need to, like, gotta watch out for that shit. Am I going in here? Is this where the... Am I going in here? Ah, oh, great. Down into the uh, deep dark dungeon. Wow. Okay. Old archives. What the shit? He fell to the kitchen floor. Tears were beginning to well in his eyes as he received his f the first kick in his stomach. Hazel remained hidden in fear. She too would be punished. What the bloody shit. Um, <clears throat> now witnessing unsettling events will reduce your sanity. It can be increased by completing puzzles and, and making progress. Okay, so do I have a sanity meter? The wear when staying in darkness, your sanity will slowly drain. Turn on lights in the environment using tinderboxes or search for other sources of light. Like this right here. Is this a source of light? It's light on me. Whew. Yeah, this is not Skyrim. See, what the... Um, okay, well, we're not going that way. Oh, they're right here. I walked right past it. fuck is that? Come on now, here we go. You have picked up a lantern when filled with oil, it can be turned on by pressing square or selecting any inventory. Uh, okay. But does, is it like one of those things that run? Oh, what's this? It's a book. It's a book. Pfft, fuck that book. Oh my god, now it's getting even creepier. What the shit? Am I 
Uh, there's a desk. I am genuinely creeped out. Seriously, I am. 19th of August, 1839. Oh, what? I wish I could ask how much you remember. I don't know if there'll be anything left after I consume this drink. Don't be afraid, Daniel. I can't tell you why, but know this. I choose to forget. Try to find comfort and strength in that fact. There is a purpose. You are my final effort to put things right. My final God willing, the name Alexander of Brandenburg still invokes bitter anger in you. Yeah, what if a bastard. Not, this will sound horrible. Go to the inner sanctum. Find Alexander and kill him. Really? His body is old and weak, and yours, young and strong. Uh -huh. He will be no match for you. One last thing. What? A shadow is following you. No shit. It's a living nightmare. No breaking shit. Breaking down reality. <laughs> I have tried everything, and there is no way to fight back. You need to escape it as long as you can. Great. Redeem us both, Daniel. Descend into the darkness where Alexander waits and murder him. Murder him. Your former self, Daniel. Right. What's that? Lantern drains oil and turn on to add more oil to the lantern. Press set over the oil item and uh, okay. Can I grab that? Can I write a note? Can I write a note to my former self? Uh, hey, former self, um, get out of the fucking castle. Uh, you don't want to be here. Go the fuck away. Now where am I supposed to go? Am I supposed to go back this way? It said inner sanctum. What the fuck is that? Is it through there? <laughs> God. Where am I supposed to go? I keep hearing like all kinds of noises in the background and it's really messing me up. My headphones are just going nuts right now. Am I supposed to be going back this way? What am I supposed to be doing? Rainy Hall, it won't budge. Well, shit. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> uh, oil, fuel for the lantern. Oh, okay, whoops. Okay, so there's health, and there's sanity, slight headache. Um, this is interesting. Ooh, shit. Is there nothing in here? Can I turn that off for now? What about start? Oh, fuck me! What the fuck? Oh, God damn it. I'm losing my mind. Losing my fucking mind. Um, I am losing my mind playing this shit. Jeez. And I mean, it's like it's like four o'clock in the afternoon too, and it's like it's kind of bright in here, but it's still I'm feeling it. This just feels. It feels freaky. God, it's just making me feel freaky. There's something about it. I don't want to burn out all my oil. Okay, so... What's... These are all books. Oh, there's a lever. Uh, hold down and then right stick. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Okay. Um... Entrance hall. Well, a fragrant taste of rose lingered in his mouth. Turkish delights, he thought, just like the ones at the consulate in Constantinople. Istanbul. It's Constantinople. Istanbul's Constantinople. Istanbul's Constantinople. Um, to run, hold L2. Oh, what the shit? Alexander, is it inside the castle? In a manner of speaking. Come, bring the lamp. You've been to the refinery, have you not? I don't believe I have. 
Is it connected to the... What did you call it? The inner sanctum. My most precious chamber, Daniel. And it lies well beyond the refinery. In fact, it lies beneath the very stone of Brennenburg. <laughs> okay. I'm oh god, right bullshit. Ow! Hell yeah, oh, what the fuck? Well now we're in Silent Hill. It is tough and pliant, it can't be torn by hands or tools. Great. Now we're in Silent Hill. Wonderful. Um I'm gonna keep going a little bit. We're gonna go a little bit over on this one. We might go 20 minutes because I mean this is just it's not really like jump scary or weird. It's just it's creepy. I mean, I really just have this general feeling of unease. I don't want to be playing this. You know? It's like very psychological. Laboratory? It's a laboratory. Traveling to Dover meant going through Canterbury. Canterbury Tales. Uh, he sh made sure to pay a visit to avoid the sense of guilt connected with neglect of family. Oh shit. Uh, I don't have any oil left. I am going to go fucking ballistically nuts. I don't have anything to light it. Yep, it's happening. I'm going crazy. Wait. Okay, I'm a little better. Going fucking nuts. What the fuck? Apparently, something back there does not want me to get in there. So, okay, pick up the oil. I actually have to, like, do the whole thing on it? Really? Yeah, we're gonna go a little bit more than. <laughs> Fucking He-Man. <laughs> Watch me pick up this barrel with one hand! Oh my god. What the hell? Wait. Is that a treasure chest? Oh, I can't open it? Fuck this game! Oh, wait, look. <laughs> what was that? Oh, the tinderbox. Okay. <laughs> What the hell, man? Okay, what's this? Uh, the lack of a chimney to properly vent the fumes from my most recent experiments has taken its toll on many of my less stable ingredients in storage. Some seem unaffected, but many are stained by the fumes and will be difficult to salvage. I shall do what I can and move them to the wine cellar. Okay, do I need to get to the wine? Why is everything shaking? What the fuck, man? Throwing shit around. Wow. Um. What the hell is that? Picked up chemistry pot. Early alchemy experiment. This is third attempt at. Uh, so am I gonna have to make a solution or something? Is that what it's saying? Is you gotta like create a thing? I don't know, but I think we, we, uh, I'm showing 20 minutes. Uh, I know I spent three minutes, uh, talking and, oh shit. I went crazy. What happens if I just go crazy? I mean, seriously, what happens if I just stand here? Will I eventually just lose my shit? Will I eventually just die? Ooh. Man, it just looks weird. Holy crap. What the 
far as I can tell, nothing happens. I'm just like, I'm just like, uh, slowly losing my brain. What does my uh, sanity say? A slight headache. Oh well, anyways guys, thanks for uh, <laughs> coming and checking this out. This is Amnesia, this was the, uh, the, what was it, the Dark whatever, I don't know what the hell it was called, the first one. Yeah, this was uh, on the uh, collection on the PlayStation 4. Uh, this is something that uh, we get for free on the PlayStation Plus. I, again, I've, I've never played this, I don't know too much about it. I know it's supposed to be very psychologically uh, driven. And boy howdy is it, because I really feel uneasy playing this game. I don't even know what it is. I just, it feels really, you know? So I don't know. That, I, nothing's happening to me. I'm sitting here in the dark and it said if you stay in the dark too long, the door slammed shut behind him and he knew he would never again see the old tailor at Berkeley Square. Another lone soul in London seemed appropriate somehow. See, I'm not losing my mind. Uh oh. But yeah, I gotta stop. I, it, it's it's time that we stop this. This seems interesting. I'll tell you what. And uh, we haven't seen any like major bad guys or anything go crazy or anything like that. So uh, I'm sure that it just gets nuts. I've heard that the uh, the last one, the the pig and the machine or whatever it was, a machine and a pig. I don't know what the hell it was. I've heard that one's pretty nuts. Uh, I've seen a couple gameplay videos, and it looks crazy, but I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, guys, thank you very much for coming around and checking us out. I've been Nicodemus Kane. This has been Hump Day Scary Play. Every Wednesday through October, we're going to try to find some random scary games that I've never played. Give them about 15 minutes to try them out. Had to give this one a little bit longer because this is, I think this is a slow build. Uh, I think, uh... I think this one's like slender. <laughs> just, you gotta get into it before something crazy happens. Uh, but anyways, like, comment, and subscribe, or don't. Um, if, by some happen chance, happen chance, you hear me? Happenstance. Uh, you happen to be watching this and think that uh, you wanna... You wanna watch me uh, try to fumble fuck my way through this. Leave a comment. Let me know. I may do it. Um, I like really crazy, scary games. Um... Especially ones like this just make me feel weird. So, <laughs> definitely, if you want to see this, you know, we may, uh, we still have a little bit of time. We still have a fair amount of time left in October. Uh, I may be able to do it. I may even uh, get NGB on it. We might try one. I don't know. Uh, anyways, uh, thank you guys again. Um, until next Wednesday, I wish you all well in all your future endeavors. And I hope that the world lasts for you. God bless. Take care. Um,. Save often. Don't let your sanity get crazy. Holy crap. Yeah, I just feel weird. I don't know. Something about this game, man, just makes me feel weird. Alright, guys. Later.